guys, it's Janine over at Slow Happy Vintage. I'm just popping on really quick to show you a couple of things I found. I actually have a, a, a longer video uh, that I need to do, but I think I want to do some really shorter ones because the last one was really long and a lot of people don't have 40 minutes to sit down and watch a video. So I'm going to show you a couple of things. This right here is a preview of the next video, but I wanted to show you guys these really quickly and ask for your help in identifying some of them. Some of you guys are really great at identifying things. I got these at some thrift stores yesterday. Now this one I originally thought was Mexican, but it was super filthy when I got it and I just cleaned it and I don't see any marks on it whatsoever. Now that I'm looking at it, it appears to be, to me, a little bit more Scandinavian. I don't know what these are. It was listed as silver plated turquoise and lapis, but I, I don't think these are turquoise or lapis. I think it's ceramic. Um, and I'm, I'm not sure if this is, could be alpaca, it could be pewter. I'm not exactly sure what this thing is made out of. So if anybody knows anything or has seen anything like this, um, let me know. And then the next one, this one is uh, Navajo. It is signed F Sando, I believe, and it's marked with the old sterling mark. And that is Onyx, beautiful little cuff bracelet. I did pay $18 for this. I'm going to have it up for sale. I actually think I will list this one pretty soon. If anybody's interested, let me know. It's a beautiful little bracelet. And then these, um, these turned out to be sterling. They're sterling and marcasite. They're kind of filthy. I haven't cleaned them yet. I paid like $3 for them, I think. And I've seen them online quite expensive. Need to clean them. There are a couple of marcasite pieces that are missing that I will be replacing. I think there's just two if I can find them again. Uh, this sign. Maybe I'm wrong. Maybe they are fine. Huh. Am I seeing things? No, I think there's one missing right there and right here. Okay. Anyway, so those are going to be up for sale soon. And then the, the really questionable one is this one. So I'm not sure what I have here. I don't know if it's old Chinese dynasty type stuff or if it's a modern reproduction. I cannot figure out how to open this. You can just slide it on, but it's got dragons. It has an old mark on it where it says China, but the N is backwards. So if any of you know anything about this, I am searching for help in identifying this guy. I've seen some online priced ridiculously. Like I paid $15 for it. It's not silver. It's not, I don't even think it's silver plated. It's just metal. Uh, it's really unusual and you know I like to pick up unusual, but I'm not quite sure what this is. I believe this is supposed to screw off, but the ball doesn't turn. So I don't want to pull it too hard and break it, but I don't know. I'm, I'm confused on this one. Okay, that's all I'm going to share today. Really quick, short and sweet, and have a great week. Mm -hmm.